I'm Abraham Kopo and I'm 26 years of age. And I live on the one street Fiamma Komeze, Mosurado County, Liberia, West Africa. I'm currently being trained in the Shida Method at Wele at the Southern African Institute of Wele in South Africa. My experience at the training at the beginning was difficult because I was not actually a welder before I was a mechanic, but I was transferred through the program. So I had some difficulties in holding the lateral and to weld the downhand, but at times went back based on the motivation from my trainer and motivation from myself. I start to adapt to the situation. And today, I have the technical skills to wear on the vertical up and overhead welding. Two things actually motivate me to become a technical teacher. One is I actually move by my passion. And two is the situation or the problem that is currently within my nation, Liberia. I have noticed that in our nation, Liberia, we have a very poor technical you know, sectors. And I actually believe that by the grace of God, based on the training I've acquired in South Africa, I can make a difference by having integrity, motivating my students to do the right thing when it comes to technical education and knowledge. For the past few months, my training has gradually improved based on series of improvements ranging from a simple fillet well to a more complicated carbon steel ball welding. And my experience within the Southern African Institute of Welding has been marked by a series of improvements when it comes to industrial welding. They have been prescribed by the ISO standard 5817, which is the quality level B, the highest quality level in welding. What the donor and the Liberian government should expect from me is the best in the classroom and also within the workshop. Number one is I have noticed that in Liberia, the wedding industry in Liberia, they are not following the safety standard and they are not following the code that has been prescribed by the international standard organization, which is ISO. So one is to implore those codes to produce good well because to have a good well you need to have one you need to have perfect penetration and fission and smoothness of well if your well does not produce those those quality meaning that it's not accepted globally all right that is one and two is to motivate my students because in my nation i understand that a lot of young people they have the potential they have the desire but their dreams have been dying because of lack of opportunity. I will motivate students and encourage them, you know, to do a welding. Success is actually a process. So you need to keep motivating yourself and make sure that whenever you see an opportunity, go out for those opportunities, do the right thing, be honest to yourself. And then my message to the European Union and also the Swedish government is to appreciate them for the level of opportunity and the privilege they have been offering to many young librarians. They have actually been supporting us when it comes to technical sector or when it comes to other sectors in our liberal economy. So I would like to appreciate them. And also lastly, my message to the librarian government is, I want the librarian government to see technical and vocational education, I want them to take it very seriously because if we want our economy to compete with the sub-regional nation within West Africa, then we need to prioritize diverse education. It is through those technical sectors that young people will be employable in society and they will have opportunity to achieve their highest potential.